Hi, I'm Niranj, uh, and uh, Dastur is my first film. And in many ways, it's not a film that I've made uh, in the traditional sense of uh, making films, uh, but a film that I've observed, uh, a film that I've listened to. Uh, listen to because it's a film uh, dealing with stories of people as as told by themselves. It's like a portrait of characters, and I'm just keenly listening to them one by one after one, uh, very patiently. Uh, it's, it's a document of people going on with uh, life and its many shades. Um, and this was happening around the nationwide elections, that is 2019 uh, in India, and uh, so I. I I saw certain images and uh, certain things were happening around me, and uh, especially at the geography and place uh, where we were associated with some kids who were homeless, um, and we were teaching them. Uh, and so, so, I, so, certain questions wanted me. Uh, that is, what is it to be homeless and to be hard up and broke? Uh, Earning uh, sometimes from somewhere a family to feed, uh, but there is no door to your home. Uh, there is no window at your home uh, because there is no home. And uh, and in contrast, uh, there is me uh, who is the uh, filmmaker or who is a person who comes from a very privileged background. So then I arrived at a conclusion. I mean, there are certain stories. Uh, that has to be told uh, with respect to the times immediately and that story has to be told repeatedly uh, again and again and I also need to contribute uh, in my own very way. Um, so that is that is what inspired me to uh, make uh, Dastur and the word Dastur uh, itself means it's a ritual which is which is going on for a, it has so many multiple meanings, but one of the meanings uh, of the word the school is it's a ritual that is going on for a long time. So, uh, these are the inspirations that, that I wanted to see to worldview, that is my worldview and the, and the world that I am seeing uh, that was around Thane station and it was a world around the world where um, so many things are moving and evidence that there is a world which is constant and, and pulsating and uh, so I, I want, it inspired me to instinctly uh, uh, record the time and document it and maybe uh, observe and learn and, uh, and basically make a film and the second uh, one more reason is I always wanted to make and when this first thought came, the second thought was, um, I my I always wish my first film has to be non-fiction because it might itself started from non-fiction. So, so there are many collective of ins inspirations, not just one. There are so many things I, I wanted to uh, tell so many stories uh, uh, in the life that is happening there. So, yeah. That is my inspiration to make this thing. No money for production, no money for post production, no money at all, no money in life, uh, and uh, and then you're making this film. Um, and luckily, uh, we could uh, collect good amount of money. I mean, a basic amount which we needed for the post production through crowdfunding. So there were so many lovely people who believed in the film. So that is that was one of the major challenges, the finance part of it. And uh, secondly, uh, it was very difficult to make the people, uh, the subjects, uh, comfortable around the camera. Um, and uh, that took a lot of time to, just to make them comfortable. So we had to uh, spend a lot of time around them which also was uh, very beneficial for us because then they, they, there came a point uh, where they wanted, they themselves were filming with the camera and that we used in the film too. And uh, 
and because of all this reason after the shoot uh, we shot for around 3 4 months and after the shoot we had to wait for a year to finish the editing because uh, finance were coming in bits and portions uh, it was all challenging in all aspects it was challenging just to make this film just to complete it yeah so our wish uh, is that this small little voice or this small little film or record of time uh, to be seen by anyone and everyone because it's, it, it gives voice uh, to so many things, uh, attempts to and for that we need uh, a good distribution channel or we need uh, this film to be selected in festivals, film festivals. So it doesn't matter where or how or when but it has to be seen by everyone and that is my only wish. Yeah.